Hi, my name is Nordin Selke, and this is Nazim Shahadat. We are two PhD students at the GT Bionix at Georgia Tech. Today, we're going to present to you the multimodal tongue drive system. This is an assistive technology used for people suffering from upper extremities paralysis where they cannot really control the environment. So our devices uh, enable those people to be able to control, for example, a computer, a smartphone, any controllable devices. We use that through three modalities, one of which is the tongue. By moving your tongue, you can send comments to the device. Um, the movement of the tongue is acquired through a magnet tracer that is glued on the tongue um, and magnetic sensors that we have on the side that can pick up the difference on magnetic field due to the movement of this tracer. Then the second modality is a proportional control interface. Uh, this is done to the movement of the head. Inside the structure, we have a gyroscope and accelerometers, and when you move your head, this sends a proportional comment. So for example, we can use that to control a cursor, uh, a mouse cursor in a, in a computer. The third modality is a audio to, to text, so speech to text. Uh, this is used, for example, when you browse the internet and you want to do some searches or put some URL, you can just say it, and we have a microphone attached to one of the arm that converts that into a text to the computer. Now we're going to show you how to use that in an actual application. Shadat is now going to show you how we can open a PDF and read a PDF using the tongue movement and the mouse to act as a click for the cursor. So now he's moving his head to go to the PDF file and he's using his tongue to open it. From there he can scroll up and down by holding the hand cursor with the tongue and moving his head up and down to emulate the scroll up and the scroll down. Therefore, a user can read an entire PDF document or any other type of document by using the head and the tongue. Also, you, we can close the document by going on the upper right corner and use the tongue to click on the X. Shahadat is now going to show you how we can use a, a browser by using the MTDS. So the first thing is to go to a browser and to open it using the head to move the cursor and the tongue to click. Wake up. We also use the audio for speech to text feature um, in order to write a URL or go to any type of website. Open Google Chrome. Georgia Tech. So you can navigate on the website by using the head movement to move the cursor around and the tongue to click in different widgets. Then you can close the browser either by clicking on the close button or by sending a comment via the Dragon audio controller.